afternoon everybody welcome to day 12 of 40 it is friday the 6th of november and it's pretty chilly in here again <laughs> i'm doing this now it's i think it what time is it it is 10 to 3 i was aiming to get out in the sunshine this morning and the day has just flown just flown by. I had a um, phone meeting this morning with Evan, who um, has um, he's doing a workshop on Monday, Monday night, and has asked me to um, start the workshop with a meditation. So I'm very honoured to do that. So I will be recording Monday's session because of that. So um, you are all welcome to join um, this free workshop with Evan. It sounds like it's going to be a really exciting night. I think it's from 8 o'clock till... I'm not sure. So it might be an hour, it might be an hour and a half, but, um, um, you know, it's a free pre-session. He's going to be doing some um, really lovely exercises for us to do. So I'm all excited. It's very exciting. <sighs> so... Day 12, so we're almost at two weeks now. Finished the finish of two weeks. So it has flown again already, can't believe it. So we are going to um, tune in with Ong Namo Guru Dev Namo, which obviously is our beautiful tuning in, our centering, our grounding, our gratitude, our heartfelt thanks for our divine I am presence, our heart and soul. Our best friend, remember that whenever we're feeling low and down about life, then we can just put our hands on our heart, bringing ourselves back to the breath, closing the eyes, and just remembering that we are never alone. That we don't come with an instruction manual. We always have the answers within. We have an inbuilt instruction manual. So yes, it's been a very strange day today, a very, it's just flown and I don't really feel as if I've done anything. I've not long showered and got dressed, <laughs> um, I've just had some lunch, so I'm going to, um, as I was walking from my back door to the summer house, I just looked up at the sky and saw, I just don't know what it is just recently, but the sky is the most perfect blue I've ever seen. And the clouds are so different. Everything I've noticed recently is when you're in nature, the greens, the yellows, the oranges, the reds, they just pop. I don't know if anybody else has noticed this. But yes, the clouds, the clouds just look so inviting. And I just keep looking up and saying a little prayer or I'll sit on a bench when I go for a walk and just say a little meditation. I've got a new candle today. I'm just telling you this quickly. It's called a wild jasmine candle and I'm just testing it because I put it in the freezer. I'd heard that if you put a candle in the freezer that it all melts down together. So it's just a little bit of a, a little bit of a test. <laughs> so we shall see what happens. So after tuning in, which we chant three times, so Om Namo Guru Dev Namo, that it means that I bow down to the divine teacher within, our divine, in our, uh, ugh, divine I am presence within, our inner guidance. And then we are going to do um, our second day of our meditation to conquer self animosity, that little devil inside that keeps niggling us to think that we are worthless, that we um, we don't accept compliments as much, you know, as good as we should do. It's just to sort of like believe in ourselves, to trust in ourselves, just to let go of all the stress and anxiety, the fear that keeps holding us down. So this meditation conquers that state of self animosity and gives the ability for the constant support at our core being. And there are no enemies. The only enemy is ourself. The greatest enemy is yourself. So there are no challenges, there is only creativity. I know that sometimes things you sit there and you think I can't do it I can't do it I can't do it I've done it myself even by doing this it has taken 
so much for me to just step out that fear can really put like a brick wall in front of you but it's just taking that leap of faith knowing that everything's okay it doesn't matter if you trip up if you make a mistake um, you know I always saw that everybody else just seemed everything seemed so perfect and thought that I couldn't actually sit down and do this with you all <sighs> so but on May the 1st that was the first step for me doing lives most days just taking that leap of faith and knowing that whatever comes to you is the right thing to do nothing is ever wrong it's everything is the right thing and if you don't know the answer to anything, if somebody answers you, asks you a question and you don't know the answer, then you just say, I'm not sure right now, but can I get back to you? And it's just so simple. But before, it used to be, I used to be like, oh, I don't know, oh my God, what am I gonna say if somebody asks me a question? You know, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. Just be your true self. And like I've mentioned before, that's what the wonder of doing the Kundalini Yoga has transformed me into being me just not by you know being somebody else just by being me and finding myself it has been a long journey and it can be a long journey and it's very subtle those subtle changes you may not notice in yourself you may notice in others to begin with and then they will probably come back to you and say it's not me that's changed it's you I've had that before so many times ah, so yes this meditation is going to get us away from the self-defeating, self-animosity, the non-acceptance and where we belittle our successes. So we're going to rise with this meditation. This meditation is going to help us be the person we are, to be have gratitude for ourselves, to give ourselves self-care, to give ourselves self-love and yes, See, self animosity. See, self animosity distracts us from the gift of human life. That spiritual being within us it hides us away from that. Once we start letting go, everything starts to fall into place. Like, and then you become the magnet, and people are magnetized to you, and you're magnetized to them. So then, after that meditation, that five minute meditation to conquer self animosity, we will then move into our 11 minute mantra, day 12 of Sat Siddhi, Siddhi Akal. Siddhi Akal, Maha Akal, Maha Akal, Satanam, Akal Murat Wahe Guru. And this is the meditation for the Aquarian Age leaving behind the control, leaving behind oh, just the just deceit, the, the untruths, the secrets, and moving into the Aquarian age, where there will be truth, where there will be love, where there will be peace, where there will be freedom. So like we're in between that stage right now. So what's happening is the light is shining brighter onto the deceit and the, the, um, the lies, the, the distrust, that all is raising to the surface to be seen. Because it can't come with us, we've got to let that go. We've got to let that go. So yes, this meditation, this mantra brings courage. It brings a victory. We overcome the negative reactions to the challenges. We are going to be standing in our power and no longer hiding, no longer retreating, no longer feeling alone. Because like I said, our divine I am presence, we are never alone. <sighs> so once we finish that 11 minute beautiful mantra, we will then be reading a reading for oh, um, <laughs> November the 6th from the opening doors within. I keep wanting to say either October or December. I keep going backwards and forwards and backwards and forwards. Okay, so that's for November the 6th. And then we will be doing a 
um, angel therapy card afterwards. And then I haven't chosen a prayer. I've just realized I haven't chosen a prayer. So let's see. Let's see if I can find, oh, inner truth. <laughs> there you go, you just turn the page and there you are. We were talking about the inner truth, that inner guidance, that inner truth, our, tr our inner true self. So you see, it just falls into, falls into, yes, just falls into place easily. So let's get ourselves nice and comfortable right now. So if you're seated in a chair, slipping off your shoes or your slippers and placing your feet firmly onto the ground feeling the beautiful earth behind you beyond beyond you eyes closed focusing up at the third eye point hands palms facing up onto the knees or the lap if you're seated on the floor cross-legged making sure the spine is nice and straight. You may find it easier if you've got a cushion beneath you. I'm actually sitting on two cushions because I'm finding it a bit more comfortable. My hips are more raised than my knees so that the blood supply is still flowing. Just closing the eyes, just allowing, just to be present right now. Natural breath in and out of the nose. Feeling the warmth of the breath. Exhaling any negative thoughts, anything that no longer belongs. Being present, forgetting about any stresses that have happened during the day or the week. Just being thankful for being here today, for self care, self love, to allow your heart to open, to be at peace, to be in balance and harmony. So bringing the hands together, let's rub the hands together very vigorously, warming up the palm chakras and also stimulating the 72,000 nerve endings. So bringing the palms together, thumbs to the heart, to the sternum, hands to the heart. Eyes closed, straight spine, shoulders down and back, heart open. Taking a nice deep breath in through the nose. And exhale, drawing the navel to the spine. And we inhale to begin. Deep breath in through the nose. Hold and focus at the third eye point, your meditation point. And exhale, relaxing the hands down in your lap and bowing your head forwards and very gently opening your eyes. So now we're going to oops, we're going to do the five minute meditation. So I'm just getting the timer ready. 
So the mudra, we're going to relax our arms down by our sides and then we're going to bring our hands into a fist. So hands into a fist and then the first, the, sorry, the, the second knuckles are touching and your thumbs are together and just placing those at the front of the heart centre. Our eyes are going to be one tenth open, nine tenth closed. So we're just going to be focusing at the tip of the nose. And then the breath we will be inhaling through the nose, exhaling through the mouth, then inhaling through the mouth and exhaling through the nose. What I tend to do is I inhale, I hold for four, exhale out of the mouth, inhale through the mouth, hold for four, and then exhale through the nose. Okay, so we shall start the timer and I'll just talk us through the first part. Okay, so bring us thumbs together, very gentle, very relaxed. So inhaling through the nose, slow and deep. One, two, Exhale through the mouth. Inhale through the mouth. One, two, three, four. Exhale through the nose. So continue your breath pattern.
So making this your last breath pattern. Nice deep breath in through the nose. And exhale through the nose, drawing the navel to the spine. Relaxing the hands down to your lap. Fan your head forwards and gently open your eyes. Oh, that took me by surprise. <laughs> I must have been totally zonked there because normally I'm like just opening my eyes when it gets to about 40 seconds and then I know that we're nearly at the end. And this time I, I sort of like just meditated through that. The alarm went off. I normally do it really before then, but yeah, that was a good session, wasn't it? So just going to get the music ready. Oops, I need to get the music ready for a mantra. <sighs> so let's get into, um, or for those of you who are seated on a chair, if you want to just stand up for a few minutes and just wiggle your legs, just move about a little bit and just do a bit of a dance. <laughs> and for those of you who are seated on the floor, if you want to bring your legs out to the front, just give them a bit of a shake. So, in fact, if you are just wanting to sit here, let's just let's just move our body a little bit. Just get that energy moving. So let's just shake our arms, shake the body, shake the head, loosen the wrists, loosen the fingers. Oh, my bones are cracking. Just get rid of any tension. Shaking the body is like a medicine for the body itself. Removing the lymph, removing any trauma, just like pets do, especially dogs if they're moving to a room. Oh, really shaking those arms, shaking the head, shaking the shoulders, shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. So let's take a deep breath in, bringing the arms up to the sky and raising your head and looking up. Feeling that beautiful energy now in your hands, in your fingers, tingling. And then exhale, bringing the head back to centre, closing the eyes, relaxing the arms down through the aura. Oh, feel that beautiful energy feeling, sensation of that dull ache maybe in the palm of your hands, in your palm chakras. If you're seated on the floor, gently touching the floor with your fingertips and then just relaxing the palms onto the top of the knees. Ah, oh, gosh, that feels good. It's good to move the body about. We all need a little bit of a jig. So the mudra for the um, Sat Siddhi Siddhi Akal, it's really simple. It's going to be Gion Mudra. The index fingers are touching the thumb tips and the other fingers are straight. Placing them onto the top of the knees, palms facing up. <sighs> so let's just sit here just for a moment. Just closing the eyes. So let's just visualise a beautiful golden light around us. Pulsating and vibrating. now visualizing a beautiful white light tinged with gold and silver moving down through the center of the body spiraling purifying detoxing and energizing each and every cell each and every atom allowing that light to move further down through the body Visualising threads of white light tinged with gold and silver moving out through the root, the base of the spine, down through to the earth, 
deep down into Gaia, lighting up the inner earth, bringing peace and harmony and balance. Okay, so we're going to begin the 11 minute mantra. For those of you who haven't watched before, the, the um, recording goes on for seven minutes or just over seven minutes. So it, there will be a slight pause at the end of that. I will mention it. And then we start again for another three and a half. So just your hands into Gyal Mudra, eyes are closed. And let's set an intention. So just as we did yesterday, let's just visualize us sitting on the warm ground the sun beating down onto us and onto the earth, feeling those beautiful warm rays, the healing energy from the sun. And visualize yourself sitting tall, as tall as can be, as strong as a lion. You have the strength of a warrior you are a powerful being. It's now time to allow the gift, gifts to be seen, no longer hiding. Okay. Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha akal satanam akal nuratu ahe guru sat siri siri akal siri akal maha akal maha akal satanam akal nuratu ahe guru sat siri siri akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muratu Ahe Guru 
Sat Siddhi Siddhi Akal Siddhi Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muda Tuahe Guru Sat Siddhi Siddhi Akal Siddhi Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muda Tuahe Guru Sat Siddhi Siddhi Akal Siddhi Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muda Tuahe Guru Sat Siddhi Siddhi Akal Siddhi Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satana Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satana Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siddhi Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muda Tuahe Guru Sat Siddhi Siddhi Akal Siddhi Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Muda Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha Akal Maha Akal Satanam Akal Mura Tuahe Guru okay, So just pausing for a few moments Sat Siri Siri Akal Siri Akal Maha 
akal, maha akal sahatanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal sahatanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam. Akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam. Akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal. Maha akal satanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, Siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam, Akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam. Akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal. Maha akal satanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam, akal muratu ahi guru. Sat siri siri akal, siri akal, maha akal, maha akal satanam, Akal muratu ahi guru. Taking a nice deep breath in through the nose. Hold and focus. And exhale the breath, relaxing the mudra, palms facing up onto the knees. Just allowing the mantra to consolidate, to 
surround you with that beautiful sound frequency. The flow of the sound waves. Spiraling all around. Bringing calm to the mind, peace to the heart, healing to each and every part of the body and allowing those vibrations to emanate and expand throughout the world, throughout the universe. Sending our love, sending our prayers to each and every person and animal, ocean, nature, and just sitting in the silence for just a few moments. Allow the mantra to work its magic. So taking a nice deep breath in through the nose. Hold. And exhale. So keeping the eyes closed. Let's rub our hands together to end this session, day 12, ending day 12 with a beautiful long time sun song and one long sat nam, bringing the palms together in front of the heart centre, thumbs to the sternum, standing tall and courageous, taking a deep breath in through the nose and exhale inhaling to begin. May the long time sun shine upon you for love surround you and the pure light within you guide your May the long time sun shine upon you, all love surround you, and the pure light within you guide your Guide your way on. Guide your way on. So Bringing the thumbs to the third eye point, bowing down in full gratitude for the amazing power within, for each and every day that greets us with the perfect gift to open, for each emotion showering us with the perfect gift to release and set free, 
to be at peace, to be in complete balance, for the mind to be neutral and the heart to be filled with love, kindness and compassion. Sat Nam, relaxing the hands and opening your eyes. Oh, blissful. Oh, I did enjoy that. I did um, have problems with my music. So I'm hoping I didn't go out of tune. Might have lost a little few minutes because I obviously didn't know what the time, the time sort of went away with me. But I think we may have done more than we should have. But I did, I did, was talking a little bit more beforehand. Ah, oh, remembering to grab a glass of water. Ah, oh, keep hydrating. Okay, so our opening doors within by Eileen Caddy, beautiful Eileen Caddy, who founded the Findorn Foundation. And in 1953, you heard that beautiful guidance from within and wrote this gorgeous perennial diary for each of us to enjoy. So November the 6th. These are no extra... I'll get the words out. These are no ordinary times. Behold the unfolding of my vast and glorious plan. Now is the time for the most wonderful changes to come about. So be prepared for anything at any time. There is nothing casual or by chance about those souls who are being drawn together at this time for the tremendous work ahead. There is a very definite plan unfolding, so unfold with it. Do not be anxious about anything. Banish all of the fear. Recognise my hand in everything. See the perfection of it all and give eternal thanks for it. Be ready and willing to accept your responsibilities. This life is not for the shirkers or those souls who are afraid of responsibilities. The new age demands strength, courage and dedication as well as rock-like faith and belief. It is a wonderful adventure and therefore the spirit of adventure is required to move right into it and become a part of it. Move with all that is happening, quietly and peacefully, without any strain, for all is very, very well. Oh, I keep saying this every single day. That it's all divine, it's all, everything is in divine order. We just have to have the faith. Forget the telly, turn it off. We don't need to listen to the drama. Just know in your heart that the light has won, that we are going to be graciously and gracefully moving into a new world a world of truth, a world of peace, a world of harmony and love. And that's it. It's fabulous. Okay. Oh, it's so exciting. I get excited. Do you know this morning I got up, still in my PJs, and um, a friend on Facebook yesterday had, um, she put a dancing music on and she was doing the twist and she was like dancing to it. And I was like, oh. I want to do that, I want to do that, but because I was in my PJs, I didn't video it, I should have done really, but I was just dancing in the kitchen, no music, just singing and dancing, and then each day, it's like today, I just felt so much joy in my heart, knowing that everything was going to be okay, and that's just what we have to remember, we have to come back to ourselves, just when we just feel as if we feel that fear coming, fear just means that you have lost, you've just just that minute paused on the love. You just press the pause button on the love. All you need to do is press that play button again. No fast forwarding, no rewinding, because we don't need to rewind back to the past. Just stay in the present moment and just press that play button again. And there you are. Ooh, that's nice. I like that bit. <laughs> okay, so let's do a card. I always feel like, um, what's her name? Bewitched. <laughs> Thank you guides, thank you soul family, thank you galactic family for blessing us today with the perfect card for everyone. Okay. This 
not be clumsy now. Don't you drop them. Oh, so how many of you during that mantra felt taller? I think I'm like, do you know what? I think I'll be six foot tall by the end of this session, by the end of the 40 days. <laughs> I do honestly feel taller when I'm singing it. So standing in our power, facing the fears and walking forwards with strength. That's all we need to do. Oh, look. Card sticking up higher. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, friendship. How gorgeous is that? <sighs> so the red brings passion. The red brings strength and survival. Also, red is standing in your power. Having that powerful passion, the fire in your belly, the fire of God. Leadership. Stepping forward, just like she's doing. Stepping forward with no fear. Meeting your tribe. Meeting your community. <sighs> New friendships along the way. Gorgeous. Oh, how exciting. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Find it, let's find it. I know it's one of these. Oh, it's not. Ooh. Let me find it. Where are you? Oh, there. Page 67. Okay. Friendship. Friends are a very important part of your life. To have good friends, you need to be a good friend. Give as well as receive, and listen as well as talk. The angel of friendship can help you to forge strong, loving friendships. Talk to the angel just as you would to a close friend, and ask her to bring new friends into your life or to help your existing friendships to blossom. In addition, ask her to guide you in being a good friend to others and accept her teachings with an open heart. Call on her to help you see the good in everyone and to reach out and offer each new person your kindness, consideration and warmth. Know that you deserve caring, friendly people in your life who treat you with love and respect. And the affirmation. I attract friendly, loving people into my life and the symbols are a garland of flowers, forget-me-nots, a bracelet, a handshake and a lizard. Ooh, beautiful. Oh, stepping forward to meet new friends. How lovely. So we're going to end with a prayer, like I mentioned earlier, for inner truth. So, God is truth, and God's truth can be expressed through you when you attune yourself to the voice of God, the presence of God, and the grace of God. I know the truth, and the truth sets me free. Divine understanding is the guiding light of my life. God is showing me truth from within, concerning all situations and circumstances now. I am wise and confident through the all-knowing presence of God, the truth of God speaks through my positive life-affirming thoughts, thoughts and words. I am consistent and persistent in thinking and speaking only God's truth every day, today in every situation. I choose to bear witness to the truth by expressing the love, the life, the peace and enthusiasm of God. Thank you, God, and so it is. Oh, how lovely. Oh, that's the end of day 12. Wow. The weekend. I'm doing something very exciting this weekend, but I'm not going to let anybody know. It's a secret. Well, it's a secret for now. But I will let everybody know 
when I have finished whatever I'm doing. I, might, I think I'm doing it for the next two weekends. Ooh, something exciting to learn, something new for me, something completely different. I thought while we're in this lockdown, I will learn something new. So yes, it starts tomorrow. So have a wonderful evening tonight. Sleep well, remembering to, before you go to bed, to offer your forgiveness for yourself, forgiveness for others. And also remembering to have gratitude for everything, every gift, every emotion that has passed your way today. And then have a beautiful Saturday. I shall be recording, ooh, I might actually be recording this because it starts early what I'm doing tomorrow. So I'm going to record this tomorrow night and I'll pop it on tomorrow night. Yeah, I'll do that. So thank you so much and I shall see you recorded tomorrow and then I've uh, live Sunday morning at 11.11. Oh, I can't do, no, I can't Sunday. I've just remembered I'm doing something, aren't I? Okay. I'll have to record it someday as well. <laughs> oh. Okay, bye-bye. Much love. See you soon.